Hi, this is Donna Ashton with the Waldorf Connection, and I'm so excited that you've clicked on the link over here to learn about using art and music in your homeschool. So if you've clicked here and you found my site, you're probably looking for a more alternative, holistic type of homeschool and are just kind of feeling that the, the traditional school or homeschooling is um, not the way you want to go with your child. And I couldn't agree more as I have homeschooled my own children since they were aged three and a half <laughs> with this Waldorf approach and Waldorf inspired method. And Waldorf really is about nourishing and nurturing the entire child through academics as well as play, music, arts, movement, and stories. And in a Waldorf curriculum, actually, as you start your grades, and I'm assuming if you're clicked on this link that you have a child getting ready to start first grade or up. If you have a younger child, you might wanna click on the playful preschool one and it'll tell you all about where you need to be for your younger child. For those starting in the grades, you need a curriculum, you need a guide to help you teach reading and teach math and science and history and all of those things that we get from a traditional school. Just know that in a Waldorf inspired curriculum, it's going to be taught through different means. There are no textbooks and there are no workbooks, but you tell stories to help um, teach and you paint and you sing songs and you use modeling beeswax and you draw and you play games. And all of this makes not only for a most interesting and more in, uh, just amazing, um, engaging lessons f to your child, but also for you. I don't know about you, but I remember traditional school as being pretty dry, pretty boring, you know, memorizing facts about history and dates and, and things that after the test was over, I couldn't even recall what is it about. But learning through stories and movement and music it becomes part of your child. It becomes something that is rooted in them and you're learning about people and the struggles they had and their reactions and the consequences. And through art, you're learning how color mixes and how shapes are formed and songs, you know, you're learning about tone and you're hearing all of the musical intonations that I know you've heard studies about how important music is for later academic learning and it, it, as well as play and all of the arts. It rounds your child out in a way that brings about a really high self-esteem and confidence because your child is, can do so much. Now, again, I said I started um, homeschooling when my children were three. They're 13 now and it's amazing what they can do. They have so many talents and things it's not just that they can read and write and learn math you know everyone will learn that but that they can sew and they can cook and they can bake and they can garden and they can um, they've started their own business and they have so many and they can budget you know there's so many things that comes from Waldorf and really living life skills that was one of the things I wanted before I had even heard of Waldorf uh, I wanted them to learn life skills. I wanted them to learn practical things they could bring to their everyday life, as well as the imagination and other things. I think there needs to be a balance. And Waldorf really is a way to get so many different things, to look at different cultures um, and create these world citizens because you learn about everyone and what they think. And it's not about, oh, these people were right and these people were wrong. It's about encompassing everything. It's about nature and celebrating the seasons and, and understanding um, the, the cycles of life and how plants you know, come up in the spring and then die back in the fall. There's so much to Waldorf and so many amazing layers. So if this is something that sounds great and you're going, yes, this is exactly what I was looking for, um, for my child. This is the holistic alternative style of homeschooling that I wanted. It all sounds great. Then fantastic. You're in the right place. I have a lot of resources here on this website. You can click the start here tab that will take you over to um, a place that'll give you some introductory trainings, get you going, and you can look through my website blog articles 
for ideas as well as um, the sort of how to's, what to do, what not to do, and that kind of thing. If you're looking for more structured guidance, you can schedule a chat session with me and I'd love to get to know you, your family, what your goals are, what you're trying to bring, what your challenges are, and then I will come up with a plan to map out your homeschool. We'll work together so that I can save you time, save you energy, save you money buying the wrong things, and just speed everything up without losing that magic. I know we're really busy these days, and it can be really hard to say, hey, I need to take a year out of my life to learn how to do this, um, which it very well could. I like to just cut that time way down and show you the steps, show you what to do uh, so you can avoid the pitfalls of just kind of winging it. And I know you don't want to wing your child's education. This could be really one of the most important things that you do and you want to get it right and you want to make sure that you give your child everything um, they need so they can thrive. So you can click a link below to set up a chat with me or click over the link on the start here tab so that you can get started with doing Waldorf in your home and you can do it. Just make sure you get the proper tools and training to save you that time to make it easier and to make life fun and not stressful as you start your homeschooling career. All right, good luck and I hope to talk to you soon. Bye-bye.